I am yeah. not hungry. He's hungry. Uh, As you walk around, you'll notice that the music from and I'll do it again. The music from um the play, the area where the play was going on, is getting louder as if beckoning you to come back. Where where was that? It's we over it at, at the octopus. I mean, I'm not one for be like going away from an entertainment product. All right. Uh, it says, and this time it says Act Four, and you see yourself this time. Oh, who's that? Time, who's that bird with such? You're on the stage <laughs> dancing. And next to you, dancing across from you in this furious dance battle, is a gnome bard. It's your enemy. That fucking bastard. (laughs) (laughs) And he has a little knife behind his back as he's dancing. (laughs) Yeah. I don't don't like that. Um, By the way, I forgot to mention, but your rival's name is Grumble the Gnome. <laughs> Just so you know. Grumble the Gnome. <laughs> Grumble, yeah. Grumble the Gnome. Very intimidating. I mean, he beat me at a freaking dance competition. I don't know. <laughs> but... You play Garden and try to ride the Griffins. Uh, I'm gonna do something really stupid. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna try to eat the spider leg. Yeah! Why right now? Right. What is this? It's, I all know. I mentioned the griffin and something in him snapped. Alright, Garrett, as you do this, the spider starts to change forms. Okay. And instead of being the spider there, you're eating the leg of Sana Momo, dude. Pog. <gasps> what? What? Dude, I'm so smart. You definitely were supposed to. Good job. I'm okay with this. <laughs> and that's the end, baby. Woo! Wait. Can't be like this. Wait, am I gonna turn into a cannibal? <laughs> Is this what Sean's telling me? <laughs> Bro. Imagine eating your friend, dude. <laughs> Wait, that's such a good emo. What the, um, hell? What the fuck is that? It's so accurate. Yeah. Wait, uh, Rob, we're good friends, right? <laughs> really Tell good me friends. Me, <laughs> really good friends. <laughs> well, if you, if you How, use, what like, noise does that thing make again? What? The spider? No, the puffer fish, right? I forgot what it Wait, if we're using like the context, like the leg that's off the spider is his leg, then (laughs) guess what the spider is. (laughs) Dude, you (laughs) should. Why are you laughing about it? I don't understand this reaction. It's so funny. It's funny to me. That's pretty funny, actually. I'm a lot out of fun. While being in uh, high stress situations, I ate the lake and my friend. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Why would ride you? Ride a griffin. Ride a griffin. Ride a griffin. Oh, yeah. Where's the griffin? In top right. Top right. Top right. Wait, he's oh. out. I thought yeah, it was he's done. Out. It's no, over, he baby. Can still do it. <laughs> he's on it. He can still do it. <laughs> he just starts fucking riding. <laughs> Woo! Woo! Wait, that's it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, Jade, Let's I could have helped you. Well, not really. I failed to help you. So but, I think we're about to lose the team member, actually. Um, yeah. Two of us. No, I'm fine. No, Garrett just ate his leg. That's I mean, fine. My thing is, all, all of these are based around what you guys are. So Garrett's a storyteller and a bard, so that's what his dream is. Yeah. Oh. Wait, was Garrett the saying that gonna be for fucking telling insane. the future? <laughs> Did he make the future happen? <laughs> I'm, not a, I'm, not, I'm not God in this. <laughs> no, but if you like tell a story and it's like the butterfly effect or some shit. The um, butterfly effect. Yo, that movie he... was super weird. I didn't watch that movie. Really? You did it? I to watch no. at least once. Uh, time to get music I was, first. I watched uh, it when I was really young and I was kind of like. I feel like it'll give me it. anxiety. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I was like, I take uh. a left turn here and suddenly. <laughs> Wait, I, I'm sorry, this is off topic, I know. No, but we almost watched a car accident today, like legitimately. Oh my god! Oh god. Hmm. There was this, uh, like, an, this Enterprise moving truck parked, mm-hmm. and right in front of someone's driveway, mm. like uh, on the street though. So they were in the way, and so cars were behind it, mm. and this car was backing out of the driveway, and they couldn't see if there were any oncoming cars because of this truck parked there. And they just kept backing up, <laughs> and they just kept going, and there were cars mm-hmm. coming. Like it was so close. 
to having like a really bad accident because this car wouldn't stop backing up and their car cut the car was that was oncoming almost hit them it was so f- and we were sitting like right there and everyone in the, in our car was yelling like no 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 for some reason and <laughs> honk or something to get them to stop backing up we were just watching yelling no <laughs> And like no. the oncoming car stopped so hard that like the car l- lurched forward a little bit. I don't know. That was scary. Okay, butterfly effect. Let's go. <laughs> Pog. It's time for Sana Momo. Oh, I can't wait. All right. You guys are on this one, right? You guys can see. Yeah. Cool. All right. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> so Sana. Open your eyes. You're here. Um, you find yourself in another farm. This one, this time, it's not a planetarium. A nice big old fancy gilded gold and white marble floor. There's a golden piano. And as you walk in, I'm not gonna put a bunch of people there because I don't think it's necessary. But there's a lot of people in this room. They're kind of lined up on either side, and <clears throat> you'll notice that Inatari is standing next to a next to the altar thing at the front. I'm actually going to move her a little bit over here. And um, let me get this. I don't need to make a character for this, but there's going to be a priest standing next to her, and Sonomom is going to kind of look at you, look back at you expectantly, and we get some music. Mm, Pog. Soft Pog. Soft (laughs) Soft wait, where is this from? Wait, wait, wait. This is also from near. near. I need. Uh, Sean has literally just gone through like the last. <laughs> my PS4. Great music, yeah. bro. I don't know <laughs> what you mean. <laughs> All right, and you hear the priest go up to Inatar and he says, "And here, finally, the next priestess of Del Katesh. And she did it. And Sanamomo kind of looks to you, and the priest looks to you as well. And he says, The chosen guardian may now stand up to the altar as well. What does that mean? I think that's you. That's you, bud. That's you. This is awkward, dude. Everyone's watching. Oh, Oh, God. (laughs) All right. It's like forgetting the rings. As you walk up, and I'm gonna move you right next to her. You look into each other's eyes, and Atari is smiling at you. Feel a great sense of warmth, kindness. And she takes your hands, both both of her hands, and puts them on yours. And as this happens, you start to float up a little bit. Oh. And you start to move. And you hear people sort of chanting something, and they hear and they say, Duma al Dal Katesh and Duma al Kore. And this slowly starts to fade out as the pole ballroom starts to fade out as well. And the two of you kind of find yourself in this in this place, kind of above the city, looking down, the planets around you, the stars in the sky. It's very pretty. <laughs> And she kind of looks to you with a tear in her eye, and she says, i finally done it, son. Can I just do, like, people clap? Yeah, people clap. Or, or an easy clap. <laughs> easy clap. Easy clap. And mm-hmm. she does this, she hugs you and pulls you in tight. Yes! The timing. <laughs> the timing, oh, oh my god, yes. what? <laughs> He practiced oh, all night so for this. Funny. Every Actual other whole production. Night. Hold on. Wait a minute. He's oh, got the lighting. Got perfect, baby. Holy oh. shit. He's got and, fucking timers, I know and it. As, and as she holds you and pulls you in, a flash of memories starts to pull into you. Like memories you never thought you ever had. Of you and Inatari as children playing in fields above the floating city of Adar. As you grow older together, you find yourself. Playing around, growing up through your youth. Mm. Which, for you, this is strange because obviously you've had your own life, but this feels exactly as if it's your own, and these are all your own memories as if you've experienced them. Mm-hmm. 
And you remember late nights staying up with Inatari, talking about the future, her hopes to become a priestess of Gal Katesh, to serve the god of dreams. <clears throat> and as she kind of lets the embrace go, hell yeah, she looks into her <laughs> eyes. <laughs> the time so is so good. He's I'm so happy. <laughs> <laughs> the timing, dude. I'm so 